Welcome back to Entertainment Speakeasy. Hey there. Thank you for joining us. And today we have a very, very special guest who Bloomberg said that his film festival, the Northeast Film Festival, Ooh. was the top one of the premier film festivals in the state of New Jersey. He's also been called the king of the North Jersey Film Festivals, Mr. Larry Rosen. Uh, with that introduction, I was like looking for who else is here. And I heard the name, I was like, wait a minute, I know that guy. That's me. Oh. <laughs> welcome, Larry. Welcome, Thank you. Welcome, welcome. Cheers. Cheers. So film festivals, actually, um, what people don't realize about film festivals, they hear about movies, they hear about what studios are doing with these huge, huge budget films, but there's a huge independent film scene. So people making movies pretty much on their own. They're, it's supposed to be financing themselves. Mm -hmm. Um, and where are they showcasing them? They're not getting distributed, they're not getting out there, so they start off in film festivals. So these films that you hear about the non-mainstream, they start somewhere, which is film festivals. Absolutely, and it's a great breeding ground for camaraderie amongst creatives, sure. supporting the film, networking, even sometimes financial backing can be found through film festivals. I'll tell you, I've met so many actors and so many directors, producers, writers, what, whatever you want as far as this particular uh, uh, milieu of filmmaking, especially New York, New Jersey, Connecticut, Pennsylvania filmmaking, in these film festivals, many of them in Larry's. And um, it, it, it's taken my filmmaking and my thought of what's possible to a whole new level. I mean, I'm going to be shooting a feature in August. And that's a possibility, that's now a possibility where I would have thought, well, it's going to take a half a million dollars easily to shoot a feature. But you find that there's other interesting ways of being able to do those kinds of things. And so. with even that film, I mean, most, most people don't realize the networking opportunities. I yes. mean, actors decide, oh, I'm not going to go to my film screening because I'm working at McDonald's tonight. They don't realize showing up to that film festival, you might meet that director who's going to cast you. You might re meet that actor who's going to do a film. You might meet that uh, director of photography who's like, you know what, I just love your look. I, I just want to do a film and have beautiful close-up shots of you. I mean, that stuff does happen. Absolutely. Um, film in August. I mean, half this crew is people met at film festivals. Uh, Absolutely. Yeah. This is a film that Larry and I are doing together. And full disclosure, of course, he is one of the producers of this show. So we're very happy to have him as a sort of a built-in resource for the entire show. And, and be able to utilize his expertise on all of these How I knew about the feature as well. Yes, it's how he knew about the feature. <laughs> and you so. have an amazing film festival coming up, which I love the name. It's called WTF, but it's uh -huh. not what you think it is. So WTF stands for? Web Television Film Festival. Uh -huh. yes, it is. And that's a film festival that Larry and I are, are uh, co-running, uh, uh -huh. co-directing, so to speak, of film festival directors. And it's, uh, it's for web-based content, uh, so web series, TV content, pilots, uh, both under half an hour and above a half an hour, and film, but only micro shorts. So five minutes or less. And the micro and short is awesome. such like an underutilized concept, being able to just punch a film out in five minutes, tell a story, get to it quick, and film festivals love that. Absolutely. Yeah, my, they're great. my first foray into filmmaking was a micro short all about Rita and which we kind of met over. Yeah. And um it's won a couple of awards already for you, it actually. Has. Thank, you. Actor. Thank you so much. And uh but it's an amazing thing and it got my feet wet into this uh, into this uh, total genre. So I wanted to, you know, get something on. We wanted to get something on talking about film festivals and encouraging and inspiring those who are there to really get involved, to get in, get your feet wet in this in, in this endeavor. And really support cool. your local film festivals. And what I, I personally would love is if you guys out there, mm -hmm. I mean, if you have a film and it's online in these comments on, uh, I mean, you can give the social media plug, but list Absolutely. the link. I'd love to watch them as would, I hope, a bunch of our viewers. Absolutely, I would so, too. And submit, get, submit to these festivals, either Larry's or others. Another friend of ours, CJ Cullen, runs a couple of festivals. And we, we have just so many worthy people out there that deserve to see your work. So get it out there. But clearly, I mean, we have our opinions and I'm sure that you have yours. So get in touch with us on Twitter, on Instagram, on Facebook. Let us know your thoughts, your opinions. Send us a link to your movies. Let us check them out. We'd love to see that. And until next time. Cheers. Cheers. And join us for a drink at the festival. Thank you so much.